Stage Features. It's so nice to talk to you guys. I'm a huge fan, so I've been watching it since I was little. Uh, I just want to start off by saying it's been five years since your last episode, Tyler, and nine since yours, Crystal. I'm wondering, what have you guys learned or what did you get to bring to your characters this time around that you didn't during the TV show? I just a whole lot of life experience and depth and wisdom and joy and pain and so like all the things you experience as an adult that I didn't experience before heartbreak joy all of that I feel like the deeper that I go in my real life the better that I can approach my characters so, yes I couldn't say it any better you know the five years there was a lot that happened within mm -hmm. that five years um, that kind of you know it, it shapes you and it sort of it makes you into this sort of uh, it's hard to describe Becoming an adult, you get a little bit more comfortable with yourself, but you also have this baggage that you're holding on to from all these experiences, whether it is pain or joy. Um, and it's uh, it just forms you into just a more balanced person, hopefully. And so being able to bring that to the characters is so needed and necessary, and I'm really happy that we got to do that because they deserved it, you know? being Seeing these characters grow up and become adults, and it's just, it's something that you want to see. And so I'm really happy we got to do that. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Thank you. Thank you. I know you've added some new characters in here as well. Uh, Vince, who plays Eli, did a great job with you guys, and I love the chemistry you all had. But I'm wondering, what would you tell your younger self starting this show, but also advice for him kind of starting this journey as well? Mm. I don't know if I would <laughs> tell my younger self much, because I kind of like the way that everything transpired for me. I like I liked my presentness when I was, when we, when everything happened, you know, like I, I learned a lot. And I think you have to kind of learn the hard way sometimes. And that's what I did. You know, it, it shapes you into sort of a more solid adult. And, um, you know, I think if I have any advice for Vince, and I think, I think I showed it to him while we were filming, I really took him under my wing and just showed him that like, uh, you could always be grateful, you know, respect everybody around you, no matter who they are, what position, um, and always just maintain this level of gratefulness and thankfulness for where you are because thousands and millions of people want to be in your position. And so I think that's something that I think I, I, I just shared innately with him um, and showed, led by example. Uh, but uh, yeah, I don't think I would tell my younger self anything. I liked how it happened. I share the same sentiment with you. I think I don't have any, I, you know, I've made so many mistakes and I could have done so many things differently, but there ultimately for me aren't any regrets because it's led me to this point um, in my life. So yeah, I feel the same way. And for Vince, I think, and this, this advice actually goes to me, so I'm speaking to me and to him, it's to trust yourself. I think as a young, as an actor that's just kind of starting, like we don't feel that we have the space to follow our instincts or, you know, to, to, do something that feels creative to us because we have to make the director happy or you know entertain the studio. But for me, like to be able to trust your creativity and be on set and just do something weird and crazy and outside the box, oftentimes that's where the magic is. And I feel like for him, that's what I want to tell him because he is, he's so talented. Yeah, that little he's bastard. He's really, really talented. And he is such a delight, such a lovely human. Oh, love him. Yeah, you guys all did amazing performances, and I love the film. Thanks. Thank, thank you so Thank much. You. That's so cool to hear.